And, uh, sort of welcome back. This is Half House, where it's just me... And me. Yeah. <laughs> Filling in, playing some Monaco. I'm fairly certain we're the only two people who in our little gang who actually have this game anyway. Yes, and there's a reason this wasn't on the full house list, which is to say this game is intensely flawed. While fun, I suppose, at times, it's really not a very good stealth game. It's more of a, like, oops, I tripped a wire, the entire world is exploding, now let's grab all the money and run kind of simulator. Which can be fun in being completely absurd. Okay. So, this is supposed to be a top-down heist game. I just made a mistake over here. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, wait, I got this. No, I don't. Over here, I've thrown through the wall. <laughs> Great start already. Well, that's just how Monaco goes. There's a sneak button, by the way. Although you can just rush them like a madman and chloroform them at light Dude, speed. Dude, I'm, I'm the cleaner. That's what I do. How are you doing that? Hey, hey buddy. How are you able to do that? <laughs> With my magic chloroform. Hey, check it out. Um, yeah, I'm I'm a big fan of stealth games, but this one, not so much. The idea is we get a bunch of classes, each of special abilities, and we play a multiplayer heist. And we sneak into a building to take all the money inside of it and usually accomplish one special objective. The downside is it has so many gamey abstractions that are just kind of gamey for their own sake that they don't really make any sense. Like, the fact that when you kill somebody, be it with a rocket launcher, by the way, a stealth game with a rocket launcher, yes indeed, if you kill somebody with a rocket launcher, they become a skeleton. And, like, a random civilian can walk over the skeleton and revive the skeleton. It'll put flesh back on their bones, and they will stand up and they will continue guard patrolling. I don't remember the use friggin' item. But... Walk into the item. No, no, what, how do you use ones you picked up? Oh, it's a button. Oh, that's useful. You shot the bullets earlier, whatever that button was. I wasn't paying attention. Shoot some more bullets. Some more bullets. <laughs> that's a horrible idea! <gasps> hmm. Oh, here. I, I'm playing Minecraft, aka the mole. It, it, it may be running time. Yes, it's definitely running time. Stop shooting me! Turning into Josh! Why is there a man in that washroom? That's another thing this game does. It puts stuff in, like, like policemen in washrooms so that you open the door and they will kill you. It also gives them guns and you almost no guns. I guess you do get guns, but that's... Your ammo is is gold. You shoot coins, I, I guess. My my problem with this game is like it devolves into chaos so easily, and like <laughs> it's surprisingly easy to recover from chaos. But I'm the kind of guy who plays stealth games and likes doing things right. Yeah, exactly. Not not just messing everything up. Oh Christ! Well, panic at the disco. Did I just get killed or what? I guess I did. No! 
стреляй, товарищ, я и сделать, как ты хочешь. Oh, um, yes. What kind of stealth game sends you into a disco to steal money from people on the disco floor when all they need to do is look at you to find you? Also, oh god, they're killing me! <laughs> they were being eaten alive. Oh. Okay, gamey abstraction number four. Walking upstairs, nobody will follow you. Yeah, it's okay, guys. I climbed some stairs. Everything is okay. The, like, the entire security force is sitting at the bottom of the stairs like, Well, damn, he went up the stairs. What? We, we can't follow him. But yeah. If you weren't listening to him complaining, like, whether if you were listening to him complaining rather than, like, looking, you may have noticed that I just I just watched a guard walk through a door and immediately lock it behind him. Yeah. Oh, oh no. no. Wait. Yeah, that's the thing that just happened. And also notice that he completely left me alone, so I can then come res you. I'm not really sure how this works either. Yeah, what's the, the gurgling sounds? I'm like regurgitating food over your bones, and then suddenly you get your skin back? Is, is that what's going on? Oh good, I found the, yes. the murder person button. Oh god. Oh, you have the wrench. Hey, yeah, I have the wrench. Yeah, this game has items as well. Oh. <laughs> Here, let's get those skeletons out of here before someone skellies. Someone puts flesh someone... back on their bones. Yeah. Any necromancy? It's not even necromancy. It's like it's a, it's even more absurd than necromancy. Like you could have just put them down on the ground or put like a Z over their head or something. But no, you have to literally turn them into skeletons and then put the flesh back on them. Also, I get sniped. <laughs> oh no, that's not good. Also, you have a guy. <laughs> yeah, you have some necromancers coming your way. Like the the moment that sold me on this game not being a very good stealth game was the moment when I realized during the dis same disco level down to the second floor that there was like a little booth with like fifteen guards in it looking out in every direction, and I I, I knocked them out and realized. Oh that, come on! Oh wow! Justice has been served. Well, let's give it another go! This time with less screwing up. That, that was partly our fault, but also partly the fact that the disco sucks. It's like the prime example of how not to design a stealth level. <laughs> it's not even that it's too hard. It's just that it's an unreasonable expectation for a game we're supposed to be stealthing around in. Like, the game gives you guns to shoot people to death with, and then death isn't permanent. Yep, but the guns are still loud. Wait, that worked? Apparently. And like, 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 just look, if you were like guarding a teller, and the wall next to you exploded, and a man just looked in the hole and went, oops, sorry about that, and went back through the hole, would you just turn around and forget he existed? Not to say that, you know, stealth game AI needs to be just like real life AI, but... Like, that is too far. <laughs> There's a difference between, like, a compromise you make to make the game fun and feel like real stealthing and less, like, s less screwing up while trying to stealth in real life, and just things that make no sense. One thing that, that is kind of good about this, and like at least for like the uh, multiplayer aspect, is that things really are easier when you cooperate because I can get rid of guards, and he can make holes in walls. These are yeah. both kind of very, very significant parts of the gameplay, and like other Let's go characters... Underground. <laughs> other characters kind of do the same thing. But these are two of the more significant ones. Yeah, I think the single player in this game is actually kind of flawed for that. It's way harder than multiplayer. Now here we go again. What detected me? A spotlight on the disco floor detected me. Wait, really? Because apparently that's how discos work. You you step into the disco ball light and shazam, everyone in the entire world is shooting at you and chasing you around. Oh, are we going to gun everyone down? Are we going to be freaking terrorists? Yes, we are. We're going to push their bodies into a giant rolling skeleton ball. Okay, then. These two need to be dealt with. I think, th I think that one is a, is a docile enough, but... Sooner, sooner or later, we're going to get the. Uh, you see a necromancer. So yeah. Oh, you found one. There she is. There's a cater. This is 
really just how it illustrates how, like, how they came stealth is kind of... That, that's some heisting we're doing. Oh no, they found my skeletons! No! Stop them! Oh god, they're getting back off! They found the skeletons in your closet. The skeletons everywhere. Give me your money. Oh, I don't think I can shoot anymore. This is a game that also, by the way, an objective is take all the money in the level. Um, that includes from every individual person who has money in their pockets on the dance floor. Where if you walk into the lights, you oh, get there, killed. we can leave. We have all the money. All the money. Jeez, no. it's the heat! Get up here! <laughs> no! What? Let me throw! Oh, okay. Got a bro from the right angle. My bad. Also, locked doors are a pain in the ass. Yeah, so just explode the wall next to them. There's also a sneak button if you can find it. I, I'm sneaking. Oh, I guess you don't need to because you have the controller uh, analog stick. Oh, here we go again. Screw it. Oh, what the heck? I'm just gonna raise hell. Apparently over there. Oh, Christ. Um, straight to the counter. I'm the mole, bitch. Here. Those gun guys are just unfair. They have impeccable aim. They cannot miss. Get him. Oh, good. <laughs> it's a step over people. I need the health. Oh, actually, I actually need that health. Oh, wow. You don't need those wine bottles, I'll just take them for you. <laughs> the other thing is, like, the AI behavior gets so random after anything happens that you just have patrols of guys walking through everywhere. No, 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 no. Oh god, I can't. Oh crap. <laughs> I ran out of bullets. Run. <laughs> No. no. Oh, 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 no. I'll try and get you back. Oh, Jesus! If the guards can do it, we can too. We, we, what we really needed was a look at. Yeah, also, that, that is another really absurd thing. You can pretty much fail forever as long as one person's left to, to provide. What is that? What am I doing? What does that sound? Am I like. It's horrifying. Is that me, like, reaching into your skull and, like, rearranging your brain? There we go. Did I, did, you know, this might actually work. <laughs> well, because I'm here? Yeah. That guy's got money on him. <gasps> oh, no, wait, that guy has money in, his, in the teller. Oh, Christ. Oh, this guy's running for an alarm. Run! Oh, he's running for a guard. Oh, now, now, now the guard's found you. Let me just, uh... It also works. Although... Man, he chases me far. Put on a disguise, no one will ever find out. I got full health, but you may want full health, so I'll leave that in reserve. Look at how much we have to steal. This is unbelievable. Oh yeah, okay. That health is to your credit. Grab a suit. Oh, jeez, who sees? Well, I mean, I'll, I'll try, but oh. Grab a suit, run around the corner. Oh wow! Oh, oh, the guard, the, the crowd. Oh come on! What? The crowds, they, they just threw this. All right. They eye blasted the suit straight off you. I'm just hiding in a hood of shrub this entire time. Give me that money, all of you. That, that is the only way to get money off the dance floor, unless maybe the pickpocket might be able to get it all with his monkey. Because you can't control the monkey. You have to just stand near them. Oh, Jesus Christ! There, all of them are dead. And so am I. That could be bad. That could be very bad. <laughs> oh god, why is this so slow? Why, it was so much faster than last time. I got locked in a room and got killed. Oh no. Who decided this was a good idea? <laughs> okay, so you might need a different approach. Yeah.
Капитан гроза преступных планов, знаю все его за океаном. Рашен супер! Капитан Тронин, мастер-розыск, любитель погони.